and we're joined by Jason Yule. Jason, um, good to be back at Power Lane. Yeah, I mean, it's only my third time since uh, since um, it's opened and the first time playing on the pitch, which is always great and a good occasion to do it. So we were just saying, just before we started, I remember from a person I've ever seen you at 15, 16, uh, Richard Evans playing on that. <laughs> and now it makes me feel older than you're now. <laughs> you make me feel older than you, yeah. 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 <laughs> but in terms of, obviously, our youth academy is really important, isn't it? You know, you've come through that. You've seen some of the players come through as well for, for Wimbledon. And obviously, you at Bristol City have a few other guys as well on that. It's, obviously, youth's really important, isn't it? No, 100%. I mean, I've, I've always said it's that it's giving players the opportunity to, to fulfil their dream. and. Me going into development football, starting at a child and, and obviously going through that process myself here at the club years ago and then now doing that at Bristol City. So it's just really want to just try and give opportunity for those next generation of players and just give them the guidance and the support and help that you can offer them. So I'm always looking forward in terms of helping out as much as I can. So just on the John May and the Danny Kevill, they were looking for someone else to do their running. What's the fitness levels like? I'm, I feel good. I mean, I always, I've always been ticking over. I just said in the change room there, it's when, you get, when you get to that point when you know you can't do anything no more, then that's it. But I still, still do a bit during the week and joining with the boys as well. So I always like to keep myself ticking yeah. over because it's like football when it's, you know you can't play anymore. It's going to get to that point where you know you can't do certain exercise or fitness work and just get it in while you can. Is this a nice, a nice occasion also for the foundation which we're going to obviously work very hard with? No pressure on these games, it's quite a doable game, isn't it? Uh, or is it serious? It's, it is, no. <laughs> it is, but as, as you know, all, with football, it's always that competitive side to it. You always want to win. And obviously, with Harvey's lot like, and Harvey himself in particular, yeah. he's like, he's going to want to come and win as well. So I normally play for his team as well at times. And okay. when he gave me the call to say that there's a couple of games in the summer and one of them's Wimbledon, and you've got to play for them, he's actually quite disappointed. But I was like, that's, that's how it is. But no, it's. I mean, it's, it's about the occasion and how much money we can raise and obviously we want to put a bit of show on for the fans that attend. Of course, great to see you back at Ballet. Thank you. Thank you.